You talking to the wrestling t-shirt wearing, championship ring wearing, deal stealing, toy dealing, high wheel riding, dragonfly flying, son of a gun. And I'm having a hard time keeping these credit card bills down. Welcome to a flare for toys. It said on Coach of Heathen, it's your boy Beef. We're here today. You know what today is? It's Wrestling Wednesday. So without further ado, -do, we're going to get into it. I'm going to get the old man goggles on. We're going to see what we got. Today we got WWE Legends. I've been waiting to open this one. We got Muhammad Ali. Now I know it say wrestling. He was a boxer, but he was in the WWE for a little bit. Special guest referees and stuff like that. So this figure looks awesome. We'll get into it. It also has the Ichiban Hogan, Captain Lou Albano, and the Sultan. We picked up the Sultan so far. We will probably pick up the other two, but going to try to wait, maybe get a discount on those. I'm not sure. Or we might just wait a week or so and pick them up. But without further ado, let's get this bad boy open. I don't even know why I'm worried about not hurting the box. I'm just going to rip it open anyway. We'll just rip this cardboard up. There we go. I do like that little backdrop, though. Now, you come with like a little stand. But I don't think it stands up very well. But you got that if you want it. All right, there he is in his plastic prison. Looking good. Look like a butterfly, sting like a bee. Woman going down, going down in three. Now, I've seen some people already doing some videos with this. Look really cool. I seen one guy had him, I can't remember his name. I'll give him a shout out. But, uh, had him knocking out Superman. I thought that was really cool. So, you can do a lot of different things with this, especially figure photography wise. So that's gonna be cool. Got him strapped in by the feet down here. All right. Man, let's get him out of there. Got that nice robe on. We will take the robe off and look at it. Got two extra set of hands. So if you want him being the referee, and not have the boxing gloves on. You know, I know there's a lot of good custom people out there. <laughs> if somebody wanted to do a real deep cut, you could go back to, I think it was UFC 1, maybe UFC 2, but I think it was UFC 1, and there was a black guy in there. <laughs> he came out there fighting with one glove on and one glove off. You could customize this into that. I'm just saying, it ain't going to be me because I ain't no custom guy, but maybe only one's custom, uh, ben, uh, Ben's custom figures one. My dude always hooks me up. He might be able to find that picture and do something like that. That'd be really cool to see. I don't think I've ever seen somebody do a custom of that, but I think you could do it with this. Because if I do remember, he did have on a black boxing glove. I'm not sure, but I'd have to go back. I used to have all the DVDs, but I got rid of them. But, man, it just looks like a great figure right here. There he is. Nice. Look at that robe. All right. Let's take the robe off. Oh, they got the little plastic thing on there holding it shut. The little plastic thing. All right. Now, I did get two of these. I'll probably leave one in the box. Probably got to take these gloves off to get the robe off. But nice, soft, good robe. All right. Not too big an issue getting that off once you take the hands off. Nice robe. Really good. All right, let's put his gloves back on. I mean, we can put the regular hands, but he a boxer, you know. Oh, shit. If I don't break it. 
I mean, I can see maybe people getting more of these two and making an Apollo Creed out of it and stuff. I know some people have already took like a, a boa and made Rocky Balboa into it, and then you could get one of these and turn it into Apollo Creed. So that'd be real good. Ooh. Say I'm pretty, but I'm a bad man. Really good figure, man. This is really nice. If you don't have this, I say pick it up. Even if you're not a big wrestling fan, if you're a sports fan, go pick this thing up. Unbox them. I know you should pick one of these up if you hadn't already. Go check it out. You'll like it. Now, they do have another more customizable one. Uh, I think it's still on Mattel Creation, but it's a little more expensive. And then I think they are coming out with... Uh, I think it's him versus uh, Gorilla Monsoon. They're coming out with like a four pack, like Harley Race, Superstar, Billy Graham, Ali, and um, Gorilla Monsoon. So I'll probably pick that up as well. But stands really well. I mean, you can get a lot of posability out of this thing. Transformer Toy Talk. I think you should get one of these as well. I think everybody should. TNT, I think you already picked it up. I'm not sure. But I think everybody should at least have one of these, man. Just You know, you can put it on your sports shelf or your mixed figure shelf or whatever, but just a really nice figure. So, anyway, that's about all we got for today for the Muhammad Ali WWE Legends. And don't forget, later tonight, 7 o'clock Central, 8 o'clock Eastern, Get ready to rumble with your boy Beef and that 80s kid. No, we're not battling this time, but we are sitting down for an in-depth interview into the mind of 80s. Who knows if we'll find anything, but we will see. So be sure to check that out. 7 p.m. Central, 8 p.m. Eastern, at Dro's Beef on TikTok. Welcome to the Toy House. Your boy, that uncultured heathen, sits down with the one, the only, 80s. Not 90s, not 2000, 80s, kid. So come check us out. Get ready to ask some questions. Make sure to come by. Give us a like. Give us a follow. Share the thing. Come out. Hang out with us. We're going one hour. It's an Iron Man match between your boy, Beef, and 80s. You know what I say, I may be leaving, but I'm still that uncultured heathen.